Crossfire and today we're gonna look at a simple third person system I created in Unity 3D using Playmaker and you can see I created some I mean I imported some animations and scripted some uh, FSMs so that the player can actually have a pistol equip a pistol uh, unequip it and he can shoot with it and reload as well and I added a crowd system but it's not that good I'll show you what exactly this looks like actually he uh, turns wherever we look so that might be a bad effect but I thought of improving it further so if I hit one he, he grabs the pistol and I can right click to change the view to uh, combat third person view so if I press one again he'll unequip it and the gun becomes a uh, child of his body but not his hand so that's how exactly it works and I added a simple bullet rail shooting effect and some light I didn't add any sound yet but I will add it in the future and when we press R he actually uh, kind of reloads it but not exactly good I should improve it and yeah actually the gun uh, the gun needs a holster so that he can actually keep it inside so this is what exactly I did till now on the third person character so we'll take a look at the FSMs <coughs> this is the basic uh, movement and I said get axis horizontal and vertical I stored them in variables and then I applied them to the animator which is in two states two blend trees actually yeah so I added some uh, animations and there we go so that's exactly a blend tree there's the basic idle uh, state and then it goes into the pistol equip state when the condition is equipped is true so I created an FSM that says input uh, get key down that is one if I press one he goes to equip and in the second state it sets the animator bool to is equipped is equipped to true and it will wait 0 0.1 second and it sets the parent of the gun to the hand so that it looks natural and if I change the uh, if I change this value it uh, it doesn't look natural so I put that to 0 0.1 if I do that 0 0.5 it would look yeah as you can see the gun didn't come as fast as his hand moved so that's basically observations and 
the third state is to set the payment of the gun to the body i mean to the hand and it's uh, tweak its position and rotation then there are two other options for the player that is to unequip to shoot and to reload and i i didn't actually implement an ammo system but i will do that in the future so this is shoot which is get mouse key down mouse button down and it creates an object which is the bullet rail and it activates a uh, muzzle flash and it triggers an, an animation ouch okay triggers shooting so this one right here as you can see conditions shoot so that is this trigger so it will go back to finished so that we can shoot again and we can unequip the gun we can reload the gun so that is another trigger and unequip is basically the bull is equipped being false so i'll set the bull to false and it will wait 0.6 seconds for the gun to be synchronized to the hand and it will leave the gun at the body and it will go back to the first state so that's how the gun the pistol animation works and we have crouching that is basically this one right here and i created a blendry in it as well that is basically uh, forward and backward i mean crouch idle and walking front so that works on the input x and input z as well yeah so that's that's what i was working on thanks for watching if you like this uh, please comment in the video and i'll make tutorial on the whole process uh, from scratch and this model i got it from maximo yeah so that's it thanks for watching bye